Welcome to the chess chapter, the chapter of my journey that I share with you online of my attempt to get to 2,000 rating on chess.com. Yesterday, I was recording on my laptop that I had forgotten the charger for and could not get my mic or anything to work. So it was a silent, quick game. And today, rather than starting out with a puzzle, we're going to start out by reviewing that game. So let's take a look at the overview. We had a 90.3 accuracy, played like a 1900, had a great opening, a great middle game. Let's take a quick look at this game. We started off with the Karakon opening. Uh, let me see, I forgot. Was it the advanced variation? Nope, it was the exchange. Uh, off with the pin, easy, quick stuff. And then here's where I made my first mistake that we could look and try, but I felt like pretty safe. There was no way for him to really trap me if I'm pretty sure the best move in this situation is to go here. If he had gone here, I easily could have just uh, taken this pawn and escaped out this direction if followed up with by the rook. Uh, he goes here to defend this pawn, which makes sense, but that pawn was still hanging. So uh, we grab that pawn. He slides over. I didn't understand the purpose of this, and I was feeling very confident at this point that uh, I was going to be able to convert this. So I'm up to material, so I'm looking for trades. Uh, maybe not the best trade, but I take that. Uh, we can go back here real quick, actually, and see if there's what I can, what the better move is. I could see potentially advancement here. If, uh, on the pawn, we could, I could also see uh defending finishing the tower opening up for development i'm pretty sure it's going to be one of these two moves oops uh and i was wrong okay neither of those two moves what would have been the move double push no you ignored a way to capture a free pawn just wants me to grab the pawn immediately i see because it still kind of leaves it open. Uh, yeah, it was still going to be open. Whereas taking here, I mean, I don't know. I don't, I don't see. I don't see it being super different. All right. Anyway, we carry on. We get this nice fork, and uh, this move took me a minute to find. And during this time, I was contemplating this move. Uh, for most of it, because I was like, okay, he attacks here, the queen, so the threat, the threat that, that is happening here is he wants to bring the bishop down and threaten this checkmate or force me to move my rook off and just become super awkward if he moves down and I push up and the, that's, the, anyway, this is his pressure, but I also felt like it was all of his eggs in one basket and I didn't understand how to follow up super well with this move because he could go here and keep the pressure on i guess not really i just did, it wasn't as clear but once i found the fork i knew that it was over because there was no way for him to defend or for him for me not to be able to trade off the bishop and then he would have nothing left uh so anyway we find the fork and then we take the win off the ff here there was a sweet little tactic here uh where if i took here and he took here there's the fork uh, that happens right here. Uh, forking the king and the queen would have been a little bit cooler, but it would have had the end, same end result. That was yesterday's game. Today's game, my recording was messed up, and we played a very long, slow, tactically uninteresting game that uh, resulted in me losing, and basically the guy never did anything, and I couldn't figure out how to win. Uh, so. Now, we're hopping into this, which is, uh, let's do a different one. I don't want to play this game. 977 is a bit uh, too uh, low, high risk, low reward, because uh, we don't want to lose. We don't want to lose so much rating. But here we go. Let's see. <laughs> on, the, on the other side of the spectrum, we have a 1268 out of, your fun, Romania at the and Zia. Oh, we are going to be playing the Karo Khan into this. So let's see what we got going. This is 
always slightly concerning to me. Should be okay. Uh, it's a bit awkward. I think we're going to push this next because I don't have any good spots for my knight. Um, so he has the London or variation of it. And we have something coming from the Carlcon. We can tack this, push here. Um, the pin's not really an idea, but getting to the knight to f8 is an idea. So I could push here. Do I, would I immediately take back? Let's, we're gonna push because this pawn's blocked and the idea that normally counters this push is this pawn. Um, so I think we want to then go here because there's no way to fortify this and then we can take this. Um, I guess it could come this direction, but that would be pretty awkward. Okay. Feeling a little bit better about this game, perhaps. So this should just be the next pickup. Then we have castling and then figuring out how to, we can bring, yes, uh, this would be how I get to F8 if I wanted to, after I bring the rook over. 1268 plus 11 on the win. Unfortunately, the person that I just lost to was a 1068. So we lost 10. So we're down to 1119. But um, let's see. I think we still want to grab this pawn before this happens. There is um, something that I want to think about when it comes to up here. I think... We can pull back and then we don't want them to have a structure over here. I can't remember what it is exactly, but this is what we're going after. Uh, this system wants control over this square, which it currently is owning at the moment. Um, and I don't see a good way of overwhelming it. We can attack this bishop. Um, but currently would be hanging, so not going to do that. Push here. I would force the bishop back. So this does happen. I think we're just going to drop back. If we get a push, we can just always push this and slide into the corner. Because um, we don't want to open that. So let's... But I don't want to go forward. I think we want to stay on this diagonal. So let's drop back if he pushes here. Okay, doesn't... Could be fighting for here. Which is fine. He's got an extra pawn. In the battle, we could switch, then swing. I think now is a good time to castle. Could push early, but then he's going to before something lands here. Mm, let's just do this. Um, we can attack this bishop now because it is not being defended by that. Yeah, we can get rid of it. Okay, let's get rid of this guy. That should give us a lot more control over the e5. So he comes in. I don't see... Pretty sure I like this trade better. And then I can... Okay, we're going to take this one. And then I think I'm going to run out this way. Because you're free. And if he takes, I'll take. And then he's got to figure out what to do about these two guys. So I think I'm okay with this so far. Go 
could push. Then he would lose, so he can't really do that. We've got our bishop firing at this pawn, so that pawn can't move. That could be beneficial. Um, we've got these guys skewered. Neither of them overly defended. I mean, he's defended here, so he could decide not to move it. But then the pawn is hanging, so I could take the pawn. He could defend like this. That is a defensive opportunity. Try to put the bishop under pressure. If this happens, we have to move this pawn. So he does. He goes to defend. Uh, but so if I take, he takes, I take. I'm pretty happy about it. I have this guy uh, hanging. Do I have any other threats available? Hmm. Do I have any other threats? Of it? I take, he takes, I take. I mean, this this isn't really going to slide. I can go here. Ooh, he's not defended if he steps up. If he steps up, then I take. So I go here. Uh, he can defend this way. This is how he has to defend. If he defends like that, I take. He takes. Uh, oh, I take, and then I can take. Ooh, okay, hold on. Let me work through this one more time. So the idea is go here. In order to defend this, he goes here. If he goes here, I take here, he takes. And I take, because uh, then that's his defense. He would lose. Okay, let's do that. Bam. Okay, so here's this plan. Free knight on the rise. He could move, but he's not going to. His option is to move here, at which point we take with the knight. He takes with the pawn. We take with the queen. And we are skewering once again. Uh... This should be relatively forced, uh, I believe. And in, in the nature of how things are, it should be forced. So let's see. All right. There's the first. Here's our response move. The quick, easy take. The quick, easy follow-up. Now you have a pinned knight defended by one piece. We get to take it. Or he loses. He's a rook. Well, actually, then he's got to do something regardless. I feel like this was a good play. Good calculations. Pretty happy. Pretty happy. We're up upon. Should be up a piece here shortly. Uh, I'm, I'm looking for other alternatives. If he goes here, I mean, regardless, he's going to have to take the queen back. So even if he does a trade, there's no, there's no defending it. I'm pretty sure it's over for this night, at least. I think. This could happen, but I still take, he takes, so I take. Oh, that's not good. This could happen. He takes. Oh, I take. He takes. I take. So, I'm still happy. I'm still happy. He's still happy. I don't see a good counter punch. He could go for the check. I did. I take. And then he checks. And I have to step back. I don't know. I don't think that there's anything there for him. He's working on it, though. If he goes, if he goes, oh, he can't go there. He can't because the, the bishop's blocking. Pretty good so far. Looking pretty good. 
I think it was I think it was not super obvious the play because uh you'd think maybe I would take with the bishop. But I mean even either way, I guess either way I took uh would have been okay. But the the end result would have happened. So I guess you probably should have seen that it was gonna happen. He's taking his time. Understandable. This is a pivotal moment, a hard play to work through for sure. Eddie Van Zia. He's offline. <laughs> we stumped him. We've got him thinking real good, guys. We got us thinking real good. Hopefully this means we get the win. But we do have quite a bit of work. He, he's got to do something with his queen. It's basically, or rook. Those are his two options. He's got to move his queen, but she doesn't have a... I mean, he can go here, or he's got to move his rook. Uh, because if he does it, then he's forked, and that's going to be real awkward. He doesn't want to be in that situation. Really, though, the best move, the best move is to move his knight. Can he attack my queen with the knight? I guess I should have looked for that. Uh, no. I would go here. Maybe. I don't know. Something that's safe. Because if you go, if you move your if you move your knight and I take, then it's only a two a two uh point swing. Yeah, you're down uh, a rook for a bishop, but that's better than a knight for nothing. Because that's th worth three and that's worth five and that's worth three, so that's Two point material advantage versus a man. Is he just making me wait this out? This is gonna be a long, a long wait. Be that mad about it? He could be. Oh man, what to do? I don't know what he could do. We are waiting a while here, folks. We are waiting and 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 waiting. Wow, uh, I guess I could tell a story. What's a good story? Um... I have a good story. Probably do have good stories. I just don't know what a good one is. Let me tell you a little bit about this. I like Ultimate Frisbee. I play that. Um, I have bowled competitively in the past. Um, what else? What other generic? I'm training for a triathlon in March. Um, the name of my channel it comes from the an idea of using video games productively uh, or helping people understand. Oh, he moved. <gasps> he moved. He did the thingy thing. All right. Let's check this out. I take. He takes. I take. Right. I think that's what we want to do. I take. He takes. I take. And that's how that's going to work. Pretty sure. I mean, we have plenty of time to think through. Uh, nothing to lose here. Um, I could go take, take, take. Yeah. Okay. Pretty sure that's not it. Just want to make sure there's not cooler opportunities available. Take, take. That's not it. Take. Is there any other? Is there any deadly things that I'm not thinking about? I mean, if he moves his queen out of the way, it's just. Take, take, take. I'm up a piece. Come on, right? 
There's no checks. Take. Hold on. Wait one, wait one second. I take. I take. Check. I take. Check. Block. Take. I'm still up. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm still doing it. Okay. All right. So here we are. We are up four pieces of material. Um, and quite a bit of time now. Where do I want this guy to land? I still think that probably here is pretty good. We've got uh, an extra bishop to line up. Uh, I don't know what good that's going to do him. Do you see it? I don't see it. I guess preventing him prevents me from... Yeah, that ends that parade. I guess if he goes here, then I just go here, and that ends that parade. Okay. Um, I can push here. Uh, then I take, he takes, I take. Um, I'll just go here. I'll just go here. Go after this guy. Hmm. <laughs> his moves, his moves are going to be speeding up. They're going to be flying off the shelf now. Ah, uh, should be safe. There's no dark squares. We got this guy. Go here. Should be relatively easy cleanup for us. Doop, doop. Uh oh. Um. We'll just go. Here. Then we can go here, then we can go here. And the uh, world should be crumbling, crumbling around him. Ooh, fascinating. What was that move? Nice. If I take and he takes. Okay. Just get us our hope there. Um, don't know what the purpose of that is. Yeah, we got him. Woohoo! Nice. A good, solid game. Let's take a look at this overview. 
At 89.4%, we had a good opening, uh, 92.3, 92 in the middle game, and 75 in the end game. Let's take a look at the review. We've got a Karokan opening uh, for the first wee bit. Uh, and here is where things start going wild. Not really. Everything is pretty standard. Uh, I'm really excited to see about this sequence of moves. Great move. Questionable. Best move. Best move. That was the best move. Excited about that. Did I take in the correct way? Best move. Okay, it wanted me to take down. I guess I... I whatever. Whatever. It's not important. Uh, best. Best. Uh, very uh, happy with this game. Overall, just pretty clean. Uh, which is good. I wish that the other game uh, had worked at my recording again. I just set it back up wrong uh and so i didn't get to see didn't get to show you that one uh, i was very slow very tactical very boring uh so this is a much more exciting game but the other one would have been uh just really interesting to watch but regardless we are up to eleven thirty. uh i think that we may be clear of the 1100 mark for a little bit you know, uh, could could plateau, could go back down, but for now, we're over the eleven hundred line, uh, and that's exciting. Uh, so thanks for being with me on this journey, because it is a journey, and we are on it.